Video shows a sheriff's deputy kicking and stopping on a man in handcuffs. CBS News' Jasmine Ville is live for us in San Bernardino with the video and some questions about the deputy's use of force. Jasmine. Yeah, so Jeff, that deputy is now on paid administrative leave. Here is what we do know leading up to that video. The department says the deputy was not responding to any call in particular. When he saw the man here on the road behind me around 1 a.m. Friday, stopped to check on him, and then it's unclear what happened after that until someone started recording it on their cell phone and take a look that has prompted a use of force investigation. You're going to see 21-year-old Gerardo Bernard. Bernabe Vasquez on the ground there on Highland Avenue, struggling with that one deputy at first, and then that second deputy arrives to help out. A few seconds later, the first deputy appears to punch Vasquez in the head as they both attempt to lift his limp body up by the arms and handcuffs. Throughout this one minute video, you can see, you can even hear Vasquez yelling out his name over and over again. The same deputy then can be seen kicking him in the, in the head three times, even stomping on his face with his boot. Uh, some locals who saw the video say that it is hard to judge exactly what happened. I mean, you can see his foot move, but I, I don't know if he's trying to get out of the way because the guy's squirming around. In today's environment, if you don't look into it, it, it looks bad. Well, that's exactly what the sheriff is now doing. Sheriff John McMahon responding to the video saying, I am concerned with the level of force used in the video by one of my deputies. I expect our employees always to remain professional when contacting the public. Gerardo, he was arrested. He was booked, but then released. It's unclear if he suffered any injuries from what happened in that video, Jeff and Sharon. And at this point, they're still looking for witnesses and the man who shot it.